There's a very popular myth going around the internet having to do with achieving correct focus with AR filters as long as you have the original f filter thickness built into your IR filter. And I'd explain that this is not simply not true. For you know, a good example would be this filter right here, which is from a Canon camera. As you can, as you can probably see, it's made up of many layers. There's actually one, two, three, four layers that are you know that this filter is made out of that are sandwiched together, and all of these elements may not have the same if the refractive index. So basically, if you take one filter as a replacement out of one single type of glass and make it the exact same thickness as the sum of all these filters put together, the actual refractive index that you get may not be the same as what you had in this original filter. That's one. And two, IR light focuses at a different point than visible light. So even if it was the exact same refractive index that you were able to achieve with your ending filter, IR filter, since you're now capturing IR light, and since the IR light happens to focus at a different point than visible light, you're still not going to be in focus. So for, as an example, for this particular filter right here, for this camera, our IR filter counterpart is much thinner, as you can see. And with this filter is what we're able to achieve the right focus. And it happens to be a lot thinner, as you can see. And now another camera, this is actually from a Nikon camera. As you can tell, again, these are made out of a bunch of different layers. Like this one's got one of the layers being longer uh, than the rest of this, so this way they can sit in the rubber gasket properly. As you can see, this one's made out of four layers as well and they can be completely different refractive index materials. And our replacement filter for this particular camera is actually much thicker, as you can see right here, way thicker than this original filter. And we're able to achieve the correct focus in IR with this thicker filter. So therefore, the filter, the, the IR replacement filter does not necessarily need to be the same thickness as the original filter in order to achieve the proper focus. There are more than one thing at play here. One of them is different materials making up the original filter, having different refractive indexes. That's one. Two, IR light being at a different focus point than visible. And three, each lens that you put on that's used in IR light focuses differently and has a different amount of focus shift than uh, visible light. So therefore, depending on the lens you're using and the camera model, you have to have a different thickness of the replacement filter, and which may be different than what the original filter was.